and gentlemen, are we back from that little 10-minute break? Once again, I'd just like to say thank you so much to all of our panelists for the sessions for today and for sharing, of course, their lessons, their experiences, and their advice in these changing times and in catalyzing change, especially in their industries. Now, to celebrate all of them today, we would like to give them the spotlight and recognize their work as young marketing rock stars. This is the 16th Mansmith Young Market Master Awards. To begin, we have some messages from our esteemed panel of judges. opportunity of being one of the judges of YMMA this year is truly a great experience for me. Not only because I was myself a YMMA awardee over 10 years ago, but also because going through the files of all the candidates has also in a way inspired me seeing that our country has a lot of young great talents and high achievers. I am looking forward that awards like this would inspire more young marketers and entrepreneurs to step up forward in making our world a far better place in the future than it is now. A message of congratulations to all the winners. You all dared to win and you all dared to dream. So when others were contented, you work harder. When others gave up, you reach higher. And this milestone now proves it. All of you are one of uh, life's inspiring characters in this game of marketing. So I take great pride in being able to share this special moment with all of you. I am so excited about what you have accomplished. And I'm going to be rooting for you in your next big win. And I look forward to watching you thrive. And the best part of your success is really this that you should continue to inspire others. You have what it takes to go on with your marketing journey. Hi, this is Flor Tariela, and I'm very happy to be a part of the Board of Judges for the Man Smith selection this year. Congratulations to all the winners. Everything that you've done were all very impressive, and especially because of the challenging times in this pandemic. More power to all of you. You are the future of our country. Keep on innovating. Keep on producing. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, we are pleased to present to you once again 16th Man Smith Young Market Masters Awardees, starting from Andrew Lawrence Alianan, Mansmith Young Market Master Awardee for Export Marketing. Stay ahead of the race and to adapt to the times. We must always find ways to continuously improve and innovate ourselves. Now as part of the supply chain team, I spearheaded the company shift to automation with a customized system built to our preference from the ground up in order to streamline business processes that yielded an 80% increase in process efficiency and order fulfillment, thereby enabling us to optimize our logistics capacity and ship more containers faster. As head of marketing, I'm part of the team responsible for bringing Filipino brands to mainstream American stores like Walmart, a pipe dream for many local brands. During this ongoing pandemic, we worked tirelessly with suppliers and partners to overcome production and other pandemic-related issues, shifting focus from branded to tall products. I also served as the company's COVID response team head, ensuring that we do everything right and that operations remain unhampered. We did this so that our markets will receive a steady flow of goods as the situation permits, these maneuvers have driven the company's growth amidst a global crisis. Ladies and gentlemen, Andrew Lawrence Aliana, Mansmith Young Market Master Awardee for Export Marketing. Oh, thank you, Mansmith and Fielders. 
Joe and Chicky, and the esteemed panel of judges for, for this award. It is an incredible honor to be chosen as one of the of this year's awardees. Such an amazing lineup to be part of. So nothing beautiful comes easy. It's been a long grind and a journey to get here, and a lot of people to be thankful for. First, I'd like to say thank you to Ma'am Maribel Chan uh, for lighting my mar marketing fire, to Sir Isco Martinez and my Yunako Thunderbird family. Thank you for believing in me, being a big influence in who I am today and teaching me that people always come first. To my Barangay Northridge family, family, friends, distributors, partners, and customers, as well as our office team, all of whom who have made significant sacrifices and superhuman efforts uh, for us to be where we are. Maraming, maraming salamat. This one is for all of us. So thank you to my parents, Alex and Pax. If I have been able to see further, it's because I've been able to stand on the shoulders of giants. It is a blessing to work, learn, and grow the business together with you every day. And I look forward to many more years of this. To my siblings, family, friends, and students, you all make an excellent support uh, network, most especially during these uh, trying times. To my wife, Stella, who is my rock and anchor in life, thank you for everything that you do. And lastly, to the Lord God Almighty, with whom anything is possible, this award is for all of us. Thank you. Maraming salamat. Thank you so much and congratulations again, Andrew. Now, our next awardee, Cherry Atilano, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Advocacy Marketing. Culture is the first domestication of mankind and the onset of civilization, but it is also the most difficult profession to sell. So what I was doing in changing the narrative of agriculture is really removing agriculture from a context of a silo, but changing it as an entire food system where all consumers and producers and involved and all the people in the food supply chain. It's changing the narrative where the farmers and the fisher folks should be dignified and given enough respect because that's the only thing that us consumers will also be dignified. It is also changing the way that it changed our choices as consumers. It is also changing our mindset that the product of agriculture is basically food and food is our umbilical cord to Mother Earth and this entire connection where change the game and now how do this brand relate to me? How do this brand change my choices? How do this brand makes me compassionate and bring more empathy in the industry? And that's the only way that this narrative of changing the agriculture as an ecology of dignity to farmers and food producers and also to consumers are actually the most important. Ladies and gentlemen, Cherry Atilano, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Advocacy Marketing. Yep. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, Dani, for that uh, you know short video. Thank you very much, Jisai and Chiki, and the amazing team behind uh, Mansmith, uh, Tess and Julie, and everyone. I am so honored, you know, among all the awards I was given, I think she can just I and I know about this. This is like the, I think, most celebrated. It's because I never thought I will be awarded some marketer, right? Sorry, I get so emotional. It's because uh, for the longest time, selling agriculture to everyone was not easy. And I think the work that I personally been doing on the ground together with my team, is now harnessing recognition, not only in the Philippines, but globally. Um, for this award, I really share this to my family when they know about this. Um, they're in so much joy and happiness. And of course, to my Agria team, this is not a one-man show. This is like 
a whole lot of people down there. And I'm carrying all the 30,000 uh, smallholder farmers we are working with in Agria right now. And more farmers are signing in. I'm also celebrating our more than 2,000 farm school students, you know, who are actually so inspired because of this recognition. I received this morning that actually, um, you know, they're so happy because they said that because of this award, wow, it's easy to market agriculture. We have a space now on how, you know, we can foster more innovations and change the industry. And lastly, I really thank God for all the fortitude and the faith, you know, that uh, he's giving me and for a sense of purpose to serve, to live, to have stronger faith, inner strength, and just hope that we can come out better as you know as we are experiencing challenging times but more importantly not just come out better as as a, as a business person but come out better as a human being and celebrate you know doing all the being that we do so that we can do more doing in the future. So thank you so much, Man Smith, and thank you for believing in all these young um, market masters. And hopefully we can serve more uh, our people, our country, and be also you know, a global citizen to inspire more people outside the Philippines. Maraming maraming salamat po. Congratulations, Cherry, well-deserved. Ladies and gentlemen, our next awardee, Marielle Chavez, Man Smith Young Market Masters Awardee for Brand Management. As the category captain, the challenge of growing the business further can be prohibitive and the current pandemic headwinds just exacerbated this. Downey's role in Filipino consumers' lives is accentuated in moments where long-lasting freshness is crucial, such as when going out. In the past year, these moments became less relevant, with people staying at home more, with freshness benefits seen as unnecessary or frivolous. However, the onus is on Downey to keep growing in order to elevate the category. We've done that by continuously making the brand essential to Filipino consumers expanding our core point of difference on freshness to new consumer unsolved needs brought by the current norm we all face. We tailored our message to ensure year-long relevance and irrespective if the problem is indoor or outdoor mal order. We also dared to continue taking tough jobs that allowed us to stretch our equity. This increased Downey's relevance, especially in areas deemed unfixable by detergents or regular FE brands and allow Downey to defy expectations in a tough year, with the business growing despite being categorized as a non-essential consumer good. Ladies and gentlemen, Marielle Chavez, Man Smith Young Market Masters Awardee for Brand Management. Thank you. Thank you, Man Smith, YMMA, Josiah, Chicky. Uh, and this year's panel of judges. I'm truly very honored to be given this recognition because as brand builders, we have a very unique and expansive platform to communicate our values and who we are. This should be our North Star such that anything we put out there for our consumers clearly communicates what we stand for. For the work we do in Procter & Gamble, it is to be a force for good by touching and improving consumers' lives. So what I hope future marketers and entrepreneurs will prioritize are two things. Number one is having the clarity and the values and the equity that you want to own for the businesses you will lead. And number two would be acknowledging early on that this journey of providing solutions for consumers' needs will always require a lot of help from others, not just from your team or partners, most often actually from the consumers themselves. They say identifying problems can be a solo sport, but finding a solution rarely is. That is very true. And with this, I'd like to thank the people who helped me along the way, my work champions and mentors in PNG, the fantastic teams and business partners I've worked with, but especially my current Downey team who continues to break barriers. And of course, my personal tribe, my family, friends, especially my parents who have allowed me the runway and the resources to grow into my own person and into my own brand. I'm grateful to have the opportunity to share my experience with all. 
And again, thank you. Maraming salamat. Thank you so much and congratulations yet again. Guys, our next awardee, Jan De Leon, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Service Marketing. As a young Filipino marketer, leading change and innovation for CBRC is about bringing positive influence to people and navigating to our goals through shared vision. It is anchored in our core values as a compass by strengthening and deepening our corporate culture. We align these critical elements of our organizational past, present, and future into our corporate DNA, unique as our own. The learning institution that we are is a learning organization that we should be, not only for ourselves, but for our stakeholders within and around. Prosperity does not only belong internally, but must be shared to the world. And you know what? What's unique with CBRC is that we don't just sell consumable products nor services. We are selling bridges to the future through people's dreams. Hence, it is critical that we take this mission seriously and with quality. Ladies and gentlemen, Jan De Leon, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Service Marketing. Okay, so thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you to the Mansmith Young Market Masters Awards, to Saya, Chiki, Mansmith and Filters, the esteemed panel of judges, and the rest of the team. Thank you for celebrating the Filipino young marketers' talents and achievements. I feel so honored holding this award where I was just a viewer and a dreamer of the early award sessions. And this will not be possible if not for the whole CBRC team with the leadership of Dr. Carl Balita, who taught us great strategies and mindset to be the best that we can be until we are polished through all the pressures and adversities. Also to the CBRC directors, Sir Bong, Lando, Jack, Aya, Ray, Mams Nancy, and Dang, the Academics and Services Department, CBRC Marketing, with a special mention to Ms. Alji Gamboa, to my family, Nana and Tatay, all the CBRC branches and staff, and of course, to all the dreamers who believe in us, and most especially to the God Almighty. To all the marketers out there, you have to be the product or service that you sell. If it's quality, you have to be the quality. If it's education, you have to be erudite and educated. Same with all the best adjectives you want your, to describe your service. You have to be that. Let, let them experience you and your services. Show them your purpose, that you are not just a brand, but a brand that can change society. A brand that reaches their hearts and a brand that will be part of their journey to become a better person. Like what we do in CBRC, we bridge people to their future and dreams. Again, thank you so much. God bless and mabuhay tayong lahat. To God be the highest glory. And congratulations, Yan. Thank you so much for that speech. Now, our next awardee is, of course, Ms. Kim Lato, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Entrepreneurial Marketing. I lead change and innovation for my brand, Kim Store, by setting as an example. I push harder to innovate myself daily as a marketer and a CEO of my brand. I willingly and strongly support digital transformation and innovation in our company through programs and projects in innovation and technology. Especially that we belong to the e-commerce industry, it is really important and necessary. Aside from the creative visions and big ideas, I am eager to motivate my people to turn ideas into reality. Okay, Ms. Kim Lato, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Entrepreneurial Marketing. Hi. So there, here's my award. <laughs> anyway, um, the first thing I want to say is that I'm very, very grateful for giving me such respect to deserve this award. Uh, actually, Kim Story is celebrating its 15 year this coming November, and this is indeed one of the most important scenes of my professional career and to my team. This will really help me improve in my self-belief and to my work and business as an entrepreneur. Being recognized by a respectable award-giving body like YMMA is an overwhelming experience. It will also inspire me to give back 
and to give my best to the e-commerce community and the SMEs. I will guarantee that uh, I will make more efforts for betterment of the e-commerce industry here in the Philippines. Just imagine Kim Store just started as a college idea and this time around it's now a corporate brand. So uh, I want all the, the youth, the college students, the inspiring entrepreneurs to continue hoping and dreaming. Uh, the future may be unseen yet, but that's the way you really dream. You really dream big. I pray that uh, through this, we inspire the youth as they are indeed the future of the country. Maraming salamat po. Congratulations, Ms. Kim. Maraming salamat for that inspiring message. Guys, our next awardee is, of course, Marvin Q. Lim, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Marketing Management. As a lead in marketing for Mega Global Corporation, it is my responsibility to lead our flagship brand, Mega Sardines, to a dominant market share and bring our new brands to the next level. At the same time, it is also my responsibility to serve the ultimate purpose of our brands and company to improve the lives of many Filipinos and help in nation building through our quality, nutritious, and innovative products. Being a young blood, the challenge is to innovate and evolve our more than 40-year-old company with very traditional products and bring them closer to the consumers of today. The ability to pivot strategies while staying true to our purpose in order to meet the demands of this generation is what made Mega Global and our brand successful, achieving dominance in the sardine category and growing our challenger brands with the sense of agility we have stayed in touch and remain relevant to our evolving target market even amidst the COVID-19 crisis. Ladies and gentlemen, Marvin Q. Lim, Mansmith Young Market Masters Awardee for Marketing Management. So first and foremost, thank you, God, for this. No? Without him, nothing of this would be impossible. To Josiah and Chiki, thank you so much. To the judges, to the rest of the Mansmith team, thank you to my family for all the support and guidance you've given me. To our advisors who constantly help us be better each day. Of course, to our hardworking mega team members, and especially to you guys out there, our consumers. Congratulations, of course, to my fellow awardees. It's an honor to have shared the stage with everyone here, from true-blooded marketing professionals to such successful entrepreneurs. This is such a privilege to accept this award on behalf of our family's business and our mega team members who continue to show and exemplify malasakit in their jobs and country. But if I have only one thing to partake with everyone here, it would be to never stop learning and growing. Always be uncomfortable and grow in that place. No matter how small or big you are now, you can always grow to be better in the future. Oh, and don't forget to join associations such as Philippine Association of National Advertisers or ANA and grow, connect, and learn. Thank you again and keep safe. Thank you, Marvin. Thank you to everyone. Congratulations once again to all the winners. And thank you once again to all of our partners for making this opportunity or creating this opportunity for everyone to recognize their achievements possible. Now, can I invite all our awardees, please, to come back on screen? Keep your cameras on for a photo, especially if Ms. Flor Tariela is there. Can we check in with you guys to see whether we can take one last group shot? All right, here we have Miss Flora. Are you there? Yes, yes. There you are. Oh, I love your background, ma'am. Yeah, that's come <laughs> on. Very beautiful background. You're standing that's out. Okay, that's just perfect. All right, guys. So uh, just a group picture. Please keep your smiles in three, two, one. Okay, one more. Three, two, one. Great. Thank you so much to everyone. Thank you for joining in the photo as well. And to all of you guys in the audience, we hope you had a fruitful first day of the summit. See you again tomorrow. Same time, same Zoom link. So take care, everyone, and have a nice evening ahead.